This is gonna be a rough, uncut video. It's just a quick update on how the Militia State Armory FRT lock bar is going. As you can see, the machine is in and built. And uh, the G code for the parts is 90% written. I have a little bit of honing to do on it. It's all manually written. And so, I'm still gonna play with my feeds and speeds and, and just double check my tool path, possibly add a path or two in there. But it's 90% written. All the tools are in, loaded, touched off, ready to go. I have one vise here that is, is all squared up and ready. Two more vices are coming in later today, but before I can even get those mounted, I'm planning on getting the first, first prototype part out and ran so I can get out and test it this weekend, at least get inside tonight and play with it, look at it in my, in my you know, in the trigger housing and everything and, and look at the lockup, make sure everything looks good, look, make sure there's not too much overhang on the front, make sure the hole's not too high or low and that it at least clips in there that, that I don't need to come in and dimensionally change like that back arc or anything, because everything should be there. This is built exactly as that part that I had in hand that we tested in the last video. And so, I'm assuming, but <laughs> you know, eat, eat my words, hopefully not, that everything will be all good. And so yeah, I guess uh, we're, I'm expecting to have the parts up available for sale next week. I will be sending out an email to you guys that have signed up on the list first. And as soon as we get the email uh, sent out to you guys, we'll have the, the parts on the website available for sale. We'll let it go all week with only you guys getting the exclusive view at it. And then, um, and then I'll, I'll put out the video of us going out and testing it and, and put out all of our, our information. Um, thank you for supporting the Lichlite Army and look out for the next update. Thank you. Oh. And if you want a little extra, here's the machine your bushings are made on. This is where I manually turn all of your bushings.